Hey, what's going on, people? Today, I'm going to take you guys with me on my day in the life kind of video. Where basically, I'm going to just share with you guys what I'm doing today. Today is actually Saturday. I woke kind of late. I woke around like 6.30ish. So, like, usually I don't wake up around 5, but 6.30 is fine. And I'm just going to go through the things, certain things I'm doing right now. Let's go. Okay, now that I basically finished um, with making breakfast right here, as you guys can see, I uh, just got a couple tasks I have to do today. I'm going to have to finish working on my studying for my um, statin hyperlipidemia case studies I have to work on. I have to work on my lab report. I have to work on my um, studying flashcards. And I also have to get some chores done as well. So I'm just gonna probably write down each thing I have to do right now after I finish eating. And then I'm gonna go through each one. And that's pretty much what I think is the best way to do is just like write down. My main goal every day is to usually write down every task that I wanna complete today and every task that I need to complete and then try to figure out what the priority list of each one. And then from there I just figure out and if I'm gonna do this today or if I'm gonna do this tomorrow. And then see the time and then I also like to time crunch it so I like to put down how much long it's gonna take so like studying might take a little longer because it's more about understanding the material than it is to figuring out everything in a certain time frame so usually I give myself a uh, like maybe like very long hours for studying because it's not that I'm like slower in some subjects other times I'm faster in other subjects so that's the main thing but everything else I usually try to time crunch it and I'll show you guys real quickly how I time crunch my things. Once I write it down, I'm gonna put it on the whiteboard and then show you guys real quick. Okay, so as per usual, my room is a complete mess. So I'm gonna currently write down a couple of tasks that I wanna to complete today on the whiteboard right here. And this is what I currently use every single day, if not every other day, write down every single task I have to complete. So we're just gonna get into it right now. Let's get it. show you guys real quick so the first test I had to complete was cleaning my room so I had to split up into home school and miscellaneous tasks uh, first one is clean my room for at home write down a grocery list uh, flashcards I'm actually gonna add um, to mop as well to vacuum plus mop as well my task I'm going to go do flashcards of pathophysiology which I made a couple days ago and I'm gonna go over medchem of my statin drugs for hyperlipidemia I'm gonna do a case study that I have a quiz that's on uh, this Tuesday so I'm probably gonna get a video about that one later on and then miscellaneous I'm also gonna put down to edit this video that I'm making right now tonight so I got some pre-lab work which is also on Tuesday which is due I have a gym to go to and I have a grocery store and I had edit video tonight so next what I like to do is I like to have time frames for each one so I like to spend for the flashcards of pathophysiology I'm gonna spend one hour on this this one, I'm gonna spend maybe about two hours because I know it's gonna take a long time. And that's gonna be split up into uh, Pomodoro sessions. So that means I'm gonna do uh, four sessions of 25 with uh, four breaks, uh, five minutes. I'm going to eventually film a Pomodoro session of me studying, but yeah, I'm going to do that. The case study is not that important right now, but I, if I don't do it today, I have to do it Sunday. Pre-lab work is also the same, similar situation, but usually I can just get the work done now, today, and actually study on Sunday or Monday, because also on Tuesday. So these are not very important right now. So right now, I think the main important ones, I'm going to highlight in black which is going to be to clean my room, 
because it looks disgusting. Grocery list is very, very important. The flashcards are going to be important, and the statin drugs are important. The gym, put important. Grocery store is okay. This one's going to be important today because I haven't posted a video in a week. And yeah, so now we're going to rewrite the new list of all the important tasks. And I'm going to uh, figure out how I want to adjust it based on that. Okay, so I finished the task of today. So now we're just going to complete them. It's currently around 8.40. So I'm gonna right now I'm gonna spend clear my room. Okay, so my room is finally clean now. So right now, since I finished that, it took a little longer than I thought it would be, be but I got to vacuum, which is really good. I'll probably mop tomorrow because I can't waste time walking for mopping as well. So I'm gonna actually work on my grocery list. And with this one, I think it's very important that a lot of students, which I did before this, was get Amazon Prime, $50 a month. I mean, I have a job, so it's pretty bad, but $50 a month and you get everything you need and you get really, really cheap prices. And like, if you buy enough stuff, like I probably buy around like a hundred items, honestly, like at least per year, I feel like it's worth it. And you get the best deals, two day shipping, it's amazing. So I'm gonna get a grocery list right now. And then I'm also gonna go to the grocery store. So I'm gonna differentiate between what I need for like Amazon, because then it'll come out on Monday. So I'll buy it today and it'll come on Monday, which is great for me. And then I'll also differentiate between what I have to go for the grocery store for, which is like immediate, like that. And that's pretty much it. So I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna look at my fridge real quick and then I'm gonna list out things. So what I usually do is that when I usually make food, I usually have like a stock cabinet that has a lot of treats and everything. So this is my stock cabinet usually. And as you guys can see, I only have some nuts and some Velveeta crackers. So usually what I like to do is I usually have around like a week's worth of protein bars and everything. So I'm gonna have to buy a lot of this protein bars. So I'm gonna look up someone's on Amazon real quick. You have like a, like a low protein bar, like a, maybe like a 14 to 15 gram one, and I like to have 20 gram ones, and I like to have uh, 30 gram ones, but depending on the day I'm gonna have. So right now I've been doing that, and it's been very very beneficial, especially because sometimes I skip some meals and I get tired or bored, and I just like I have to make sure that I'm keep on eating because I am bulking, so I have to constantly make sure I'm getting enough calories to to fulfill my requirements, so I don't lose weight or or at least try to maintain them at least. So that's been helpful for me, especially since I had a lot, a lot of classes. Yeah, so I'm probably gonna look at Amazon for like the best ones. The best ones I've seen so far are like the Metal Rex bars are my favorite for like 30 grams of protein and it's like a full meal. And each bar is usually around like $2, which is, is not bad. Mostly for protein bars, you wanna get like each bar to be less than a dollar, uh, $2. So like, as long as you get them less than $1.50 usually, I find is like a good, really good, good deal. So I'm probably gonna buy a lot of those. Those are my main things I'm gonna buy, and that's pretty much it.
So I just finished my first study session for 25 minutes. So now the next one we're gonna do is do a five minute break, uh, some water real quick, walk around, and then start the next 25 minute session. Okay, the second session is now done. This has to do, uh, so basically I basically finished up the entire uh, document. I just have a little more left to do, so I'll probably just finish it in the next session. And I'm probably gonna start doing the rest of the PowerPoint and the rest of the drugs besides dying drugs, besides hyperlipidemia. Okay, so I finished studying for today. So the main goal is just to work out, do my grocery shopping, which I put a list for, and I'm gonna head on tonight, and I'm gonna actually go over my flashcards that I couldn't be able to before. I'm gonna go over them tonight, and I'm probably gonna see what and then plan for tomorrow. Things I wanna accomplish that I couldn't do today. Okay, just fans up a gym session. It was pretty good. Mainly she just do mostly uh, mostly just cardio, as you guys can see. And I did a lot of ab exercises. That was pretty much my entire workout. It's a pretty active rest day basically. And today, right now, getting for tomorrow, which is gonna be a leg day, which I'm gonna hate, but gotta get through it. So right now I'm gonna go to the supermarket real quick and I'm gonna get some food for the week that I've written out already on my to-do list already so I know exactly what I'm getting and I'm only getting those things because you know your boy's broke so yeah okay so I'm back from the grocery store and I'm gonna finish up with cooking I'm gonna make some uh let's see we got we got some mixed veggies some broccoli and some uh, ground chicken. So I bought both ground chicken and ground turkey. I'm just gonna finish up by making the ground chicken today. And then tomorrow I'm gonna work on the ground turkey. That's three pounds. So I don't really need that much. And that's pretty much it for the week. I'm gonna meal prep it the entire week. And I'll show you guys real quick. So that's pretty much the end of the video. And I'm gonna also, while I'm cooking, I'm gonna work on some flashcards which I made previously on my phone. So, one of the great things about Quizlet, I got the flashcards here. Okay, so I think I'm gonna end today's video right now. I uh, completed a, a very good amount of tasks and I'm glad you guys stuck with me this entire time. So, I'm just going to finish up with eating some dinner, which is going to be just some regular uh, rice, beans, and chicken. This is the chicken. And stuff with some hot sauce. I have some uh, flashcards I want to go over. And then that's pretty much going to be my night for the rest of tonight. And tomorrow I'm going to just do the same thing again. 
for the weekend. And I'm probably gonna share daily life of me during the school day, but the weekend is usually this small work. I usually do about like a lot more studying usually. So since uh, it's around 10 o'clock right now, um, I'm kind of feeling the kind of stress of the test and everything right now. So I think I'm gonna study for maybe a couple, maybe like an hour or two extra, just cause I feel like the stress coming in and I know that like, if I don't prepare more, I'm definitely gonna feel the stress in the next couple of days. So catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching, bye.